one more time. <laughs> so this is for the upload. So anybody that's not watching, they, they can catch up on what's happening. So uh, today is a beautiful day for science. Currently, we're looking at an X 5.89 that occurred at the merging point of the regions 3668 and 3664. As the dynamic duo continues to give us some beautiful activity along with uh, associated solar storms with those solar flares. This uh, 5.89 comes at the turn of the, the Zulu date of 11 May to, uh, 2024 and it is launching a significant solar storm, one that is actually beautiful to see the shockwave on the uh, especially 193 and and the, the images 211. All the images are focused more towards the corona where we can see that shockwave play out more intri intricately. Um, however, uh, this storm is headed towards uh, Earth. It will be encompassing. The core data from Stereo Ahead doesn't show a full halo, which means that this isn't going to be a direct uh, head-on, but it is going to be enough that it will be the same as if it were, all things considering. So let's pull that up real quick. As soon as I can find that window. There we are. All right. So looking at the Stereo Ahead core, we can see this event as it occurs. And I do believe it's actually more encompassing than that, but Stereo Ahead doesn't have as good of a fine-tuned point that I would like right now, based upon probably with a lot of the other selectivity that's happening. So we can't really see in perfect fine detail on that left end. That's kind of bothering me a little bit. But nonetheless, this does capture the right side of that ICME quite beautifully, and we see that we will be encompassed in that. And it is moving pretty quickly. I've measured approximately 36 hours, plus or minus 6 hours. So that is the update. And uh, have a wonderful day. Cheers and science on.